Mexico's first public hearing on UFOs featured quite an extraordinary event today. Tuesday, rather. Officials were shown what are purported to be remains of non-human beings that are up to 1,800 years old. Chief Correspondent Jonathan Hunt has the fascinating story from Los Angeles. I am confident that this is just the beginning. Former U.S. Navy pilot Ryan Graves believes these remains of alleged non-human beings may be part of the truth that is not just out there, but is in fact already known by governments, including our own. There's a whole fleet of them. The mummified bodies with elongated heads and only three fingers on each hand were discovered in Peru in 2017 and presented at a Mexican congressional hearing Tuesday to discuss a law that, if passed, would make Mexico the first country to formally acknowledge that alien life forms have visited Earth. You solemnly swear. Graves also testified at a U.S. congressional hearing in July, investigating what are now termed unexplained anomalous phenomena, or UAPs. Since 2021, all UAP videos are classified as secret or above. This level of secrecy not only impedes our understanding, but fuels speculation and mistrust. A Mexican journalist and researcher, Jaime Maussan, told the Mexican congressional hearing that scientists have proven that the DNA of the mummified beings is not human. Maussan made similar claims about a different mummy discovered in 2015. That turned out to be a human child. But Maussan says this is different. Hay una demostración clara. There is a clear demonstration that we are dealing with non-human specimens. And as pressure grows for more answers on what we really know about alleged visits to Earth by aliens, NASA will weigh in tomorrow to discuss its findings from a UAP study it commissioned last year. Although NASA officials are already warning it is currently, quote, impossible to draw firm scientific conclusions.